before we close, I'd just like to highlight a few last things. So I'm back in the LibGuide checking out some of our resources and as usual on the key documents page. We've already looked at many from this section, including Business Source Complete, Business Insights, Passport, and Edgar and Cedar below. But I'd like to highlight a few others that may be useful to you here. Reuters is an open website that's always available to you no matter where you are, campus or off. It's just an open source platform, similar to a newspaper. And it has a lot of great information. And like many of the others, you can simply search your company and there will be a lot of good information. I'm not going to get into it. I'll just quickly show you what it looks like. So as usual, I can just click on my company and it's going to give me an interesting overview, including a lot of stock information and news stories related to it. So just keep an eye on that. This could be another great source. Another one uh, is actually a database that you could use in some of your other courses or perhaps you've encountered earlier called Canadian Business and Current Affairs. So this one is a database where you will have to log in. But the interesting thing about this one is that it's a Canadian content. So if you do have a Canadian company and you want some relevant news stories, this will be a great source to look at. It may also have uh, academic sources. So it's a good place to take a look. All right, so now that my page loaded, I'll just show you quickly. Starbucks obviously isn't a Canadian company, but it does have branches and locations in Canada. So I think it's worth giving it a try. As you can see, I have 14,000 results. So I can limit to a variety of different types of sources. And of course, if I wanted to talk about other aspects, I can throw in those other terms. So again, just a quick show, just to quickly show you that this is out there. With the rest of our resources, I'm not gonna show you any other ones today, but as you can see, we do have a number of other ones here that I haven't even touched on. So each one has a explanation describing what you can use that resource for, as well as other tabs to see different resources. So just because I didn't show a resource today doesn't mean it's not a useful one, it's just that I didn't have enough time to do it. So don't be afraid to poke around at everything on this page because different things are gonna be useful to different people and different group projects. So depending on your company, other things will have different value to you. So be sure to check out the other resources on this page and thank you so much for watching.